Welcome to Miami, 47. The innovation race is on its last day, and it is down to the wire. Thousands of eager fans are gathered for the final laps of this unexpectedly close race. Sierra Knox is expertly piloting her red Kronstadt car. Her father, Robert Knox, roams the nearby Expo building where Kronstadt is showcasing its new prototype car. The Kronstadt RK Mark III has seen fierce competition from the Chinese Kowloon Heavy Industries' new racer. Moses Lee, CEO of Kowloon, has taken a dominant lead and looks invincible. Sierra Knox will need to risk it all if she wants to win for the third year in a row. The stakes are as high as they can get. Yee yeah, y'all, yeah, yee yeah. it's your boy Purple, back at it again with another video, and I messed up so many times recording this video that I cannot count them on my hand. And one thing that I did was I made the clip that I recorded my intro in the most boring thing ever, so I'm redoing it. So, hello, I'm Purple. Subscribe. Thank you. The gameplay starts I'm now. I'm not sure where to go, because over here... I think, yeah, there's there's a target over here, but we can't go anywhere because then we're on the track. Okay, so... I need to find a way to, like, get a lockpick or keys or become someone important. Oh, look, we're on the other side. What's this? Podium club pass. I'm a VIP! But I am trespassing. See, what? Why can't I grab that? Grab it. Okay. Now we're gonna go up here. I'm still. Okay. Going to do him because we don't want him far enough. Yo, that's probably an ending. Oh no, never mind. I was gonna say that's probably a way to get a kill. It's just like it's like push him off in front of her car and then she like crashes. Which one is she? She's in the front, isn't it? Jesus, she's miles ahead of these people. Hold on, what? Wait, where the f where did it go? She passed by? And those people are just passing. Okay, here she comes. She, I know she's the red one. Oh, yeah, she's competing with that other one. But, God, they're like light years ahead of everyone else. Okay. So. Open this. I'm still trash by okay. So it's because of oh there's an elevator chef right there. So everyone in here is, knows that I'm trespassing. Great. Rat poison. Dude, rat poison always comes in handy. Oh there's something here. Yes. Can we go up? No, we're at the top. Okay, so. Where's this guy? This Robert guy. Okay. We need to. Over here. I've been recorded. Great. Are you. No, Sir, goddamn. We're currently trespassing. Remain calm. Don't even think about it. What are you talking about, bro? What are you talking about? Run, run, motherfucker, run, motherfucker, run, motherfucker. Jump! I don't know what y'all talking about. I'm all the way on the ground floor, bro. 
Can you believe these children trying to accuse me? Yo, frack you, okay? <gasps> oh! Oh! We can do it! We can do it! Yes! Yes, 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 yes. Yes, yes, yes. yes. I'm here now, ready to meet up with Sierra Knox over at the hotel. Yeah, after the race. I just got to pick up the documents from my van, but, um, I had to knock out a guy and steal his flamingo outfit. Now I can't even find my car keys. Yeah, I know it's dumb. I think I lost them in the scuffle, but the real mascot is still over there. If I don't get them, I've got no evidence. Buy by money. I don't know. I, I, I need to figure something out. Talk soon. Ah. A Kronstadt employee has acquired some dirt on Sierra Knox and intends on blackmailing her. Disguised as one of the racing mascots, he plans to meet Sierra by the old motel. Well, I always did feel that pink. Okay. Well, f that. I want his suit. Oh, this will kill him? Well, you're pretty fucking retarded. Gayate. Gayate. Oh, fuck. Wow, they're like driving on top of us. There's no hiding places here. We're just gonna leave it right here. Alright! <laughs> What are you guys talking about, huh? Huh? Did you guys say something? Because... Oh... Hold on, wait. The, um... The guy dropped something over here. What is it? Parking ticket. Oh. I'm not paying for this dude's fine, so... Hola. Oh, wow. Pick up incriminating documents. What? Just to give you a big old fuck you. Oh wait, what? The race ends? I'm now in the streets of Miami. Huh? Kind of accurate. What? I thought I said something to him. I apologize. Sorry. Forty-seven. The race is over. Sierra will be coming off the track any time now. Really brings out your eyes. I have the papers, right? I'm sorry, I just I hate the R2 thing. So far so good for what you Now, let's see where this meeting is headed. Oh. She's walking with a mascot. Oh, wait, what? No, not anymore. Is she? The mascot is following her. Oh no, this is scary. Bro, I'm gonna get jumped by a mascot as a mascot. <gasps> Mascotception. Did she win? Do we have any way of knowing? So, mister. Hmm. I never did catch your name. Names are for friends. Straight to the point in all business. Walk with me. Where are we going? Don't worry. What am I gonna do? Kill you in broad daylight. I just want a bit of privacy. Not about to do sensitive business like this in front of an audience. Go so just to get this straight, you claimed in your email to have somehow found internal reports that show Kronstadt's involvement in the Tongan Valley Massacre. Sounds about right. Let's be clear. You and I are having this meeting because my father doesn't need to know about this. It's just another undesired distraction. 
I don't care if the information is true or false. I don't care if it mentions moving money from the Nexus Project into Tungan Valley Damage Control, as you claimed in your correspondence. I do care about protecting my father, which is why you and I are now here. I see. Leave me alone for a few minutes, guys. Sure thing, Mr. Okay. Fuck off. Okay, you want me back up? Got you. If you could quit breathing directly on me, I'd be grateful. Okay, bitch. Hey. Oh shit. Guy out there. Target fine. down. Next up, Robert Knox. You're fine, bro. Come here. Look, you're good. Guy out there. I'm just gonna take your disguise. Okay. We're fine. <laughs> Open. Alright, so where's this fucker now? If you're wondering why we're just picking up everything, it's because the more stuff that you have, the better it is, no matter what. Okay, that's a fact. Oh, we're in her garage. Yeah, she's dead now. Heh 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 heh. Your client's dead. Hello, brother. Oh look, he called me brother. Whoa. No, I know where the freaking security footage is, and I'm not letting that ruin my score. I don't care. We're going to destroy it. It wouldn't let me drop move. Move then, I don't care. I have a baseball bat. I will torch every single one of you. Okay, there's someone right there. Okay, looks like we're going through this garage. Huh? Y'all hear something? Oh, so the the green car did I'm trying to get to the front. I think this is near where it is. Yes, this is the front. Okay, I'm trying to delete the security footage. It's right here. It's right in here. Okay. So there's just a shotgun. Okay, buddy. We literally could have just We literally could have just done that the whole time. Oh, the we could have done okay. Where's this last guy? Off, yo. Why are you here? Fuck you. I'm just gonna run. I swear. Wait, a pull. Ha ha! God damn. I was gonna say, like, it's a hostile area because I'm on the pole? Or because of like where I'm going roof garden I'm, I'm, I'm 
No, I just want to just like walk up behind him. Fucking pow Oh shit. Well, that guy would have seen me. Alright. I don't know, my heart is like really shaking right now because I wanna just. God damn you, whoever you are. What the fuck is all this? No, th this th that room has a purpose. I'm convinced. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. No, you definitely be allowed to like shoot somebody from here because look at this. Look, I could light up all these people. I, I, uh, there's something always fishy about storage rooms. I'll tell you that much. So, though, we could drop down that ledge. Okay, he's in here. I remake this whole thing. Both targets down. Well done, 46. Look at this. Your boy had a plan this whole time. Drop that. Drop that. I don't know what y'all talking about. Huh? Someone died? Who died? What's happening? Is there a way out through here? Why is there a pro painting? You know I'm not gonna ask questions. Is my mic muted? No. Okay, so now we're just gonna leave. Kind of the plan. Um, yeah. I don't know. Um, I I guess that was a good kill. I didn't do a story, which I I feel like is kind of badass. I love when I don't do a story, but. Yeah. Um. Okay. Look at that badass motherfucker. Just walking out. Hmm, hmm, hmm. And that lady still glitched there. Beautiful. Okay, I'm gonna be myself because their story. Berlin. Shanghai. Montreal. We're bleeding operatives. Panic is spreading, and now we are axing our own? Knox was a traitor. He would have caused incalculable damage. And he won't be the last. This is exactly what the enemy wants. We need to fight the sickness, not the symptom. And I have just the tool for the job. Right. The Burnwood woman. Eric Soders warned you about her, didn't he? The Crusader. I can handle Miss Burnwood. Everyone hates power until you offer them some. And, and you ought to know. ICA speaks the enemy's language. We need them. And once we don't... <laughs> We'll cross that bridge when we get there. Fact remains, we are shadow boxing. We need to know who we are up against. I was getting to that. His name is Lucas Gray, the late Mr. Cobb's head of security. Cobb was ground zero, first of our operatives to die. It had to be one of his staff, someone with military training and access to the plane. Yeah, grasping at straws. Gray is a mercenary, a veteran of every backwater tragedy you've ever ignored on the five o'clock news. 
Chechnya, Sierra Leone, the list goes on, but before 89, nothing. No records of any kind. Oh, come on. CIA, KGB, plenty of spies went dark. After the curtain was lifted, I cast a very wide net. Lucas Gray simply does not exist. <clears throat> if you're all quite done wetting yourselves with excitement, I couldn't give two shits where he came from. I only want to know one thing. How does he know about us? I swear to God, this hearts and flowers crap will get us both killed. Can't you see? Your so-called friend is working for them now. He's not the man you knew. This is his fight too, Olivia. Even if he doesn't realize it. Like it or not, 47 is our last and only lead on the partners. He needs to remember. He's coming for us. And unlike you, he won't hesitate. Just get me inside. Rico. I need a favor. Okay. So remember when I told you in the intro how I messed up so many times I couldn't count it? Yeah. Um, if, if you were paying attention... You saw that when I went to go kill Robert, I, I think his name is Robert, Robert Knox. Um, I went from inside the room, a jump cut happened, and then I was walking into the room. Yeah, that wasn't just your eyes playing with you, that was me. Um, because my video clip had ended when I was recording that. And I didn't, and I wasn't aware of it, so I killed him, escaped, filmed the, 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 like, cutscene and the outro and it wasn't recording so that was great um yeah so yeah it's uh, today's been fun doing this video man um other than that i mean it's been your boy purple and i should be doing more of these i might have a hitman 2 review coming out soon but you know what here en enjoy some bloopers while I talk um it's been your boy purple and I thank you for watching don't forget to like and subscribe thank you um it's been your boy purple see you soon come on we popping him should have kept running You got care? You got care? We ah! I don't know what y'all talking about. I ain't killed nobody. Y'all don't got no proof. Y'all totally didn't just see me shooting at all those people. I don't know what you're talking about.